You've probably seen variations of world maps decorated by picture frames of where people have been to. In today's video, I'll show you my take on this. Now the particular map that I've gone for from Hogard is a metal map. Now it's constructed of metal and it's angular in the way that it represents the world map. Uh, it's actually raised off the wall about one and a half centimeters. So it will give a nice 3D effect to essentially what would usually be a flat map. So let's get this open. Now it does come securely packaged in this cardboard box. It takes a bit of yanking to get the staples up. So these are the instructions. It's going to require some measurements and some grilling. I've got the first piece here. Now these are actually quite easy to install. As you can see, there's these hooks here. Now it just simply requires one single screw and it'll be hooked on that particular screw. So it's actually quite easy to install. I thought there might be multiple screws holding in place. But it seems like it's just a single screw for, well, at least this continent, which if you can tell, any guesses, <laughs> should be easy. This is a neat little trick I picked up over the years. Basically, when you're drilling a hole and you don't want to hoover up afterwards, vacuum up afterwards, I should say, um, basically get an envelope, any envelope, put it underneath where you're going to drill. So this is the hole I'm going to drill, put a bit of tape, and the envelope will catch all the dust. Neat, easy, and then you can just chuck the envelope away. As builders and people in the industry would say, always measure twice and drill once. Also, make sure you use the correct wall plugs for your particular type of wall. Once you've done that, hang the first continent up and it should self-balance. From the first hole, you need to then measure out the second hole and then do the same again. So this is how it looks when finished. Of course, I've already gone ahead and hung my frames up. So in my case, I've chosen a suitably sized small frame from IKEA. The frames didn't really have anything to hook onto the wall easily with, so what I used instead was some double-sided Velcro tape. For the lines, I'm using grid tape here. So what do you guys think? This is my take on a world map with picture locations of where I've been to. Let me know in the comments below what you think of this and if you've got something similar like this, I'd love to see what you've done. And leave a comment below if you think you can guess all the locations that are displayed here. And of course, stay subscribed while I explore the world and add further locations to this map.